Chapter 13 Communication Connecting the World Let's learn Letters Telegraph Teleprinter Telephone Facsimile Machine Email Mass Communication Print Media Radio and Television Internet Cinema Advertisements Communication is the sending and receiving of spoken or written messages between people at different places. About 5,000 years ago, humans developed language to speak and then writing to communicate. They wrote their thoughts and ideas first on clay tablets, then on palm leaves or skin of animals and much later on paper. People wrote their messages by their hand. But in 1443, Johannes Gutenberg made it possible to communicate with many people at the same time by his invention of the printing press. Now, more books began to be printed in less time. All these are means of communication which have enabled us to communicate with each other. Let's know more about the means of communication. As we know that in the past, people were able to send and receive messages only through pigeons or horse riders. As time passed, various other means of communication were developed. Today, we have different means of communication which can be used at individual levels. Here, we shall discuss some common means of communication. Letters Letters were the most common means of communication until a few decades ago. We can send letters through post offices. Postage stamps are the cost of sending letters. A postage stamp may include a lot of information about the history and culture of a place. Letters sent by airmail reach much faster than those sent by land or sea. Telegraph The telegraph was invented by Samuel F. B. Morse in 1844. It was an early system of sending messages over long distances by wires. The telegraph used the Morse code language called dots and dashes. Each letter had its own dot-dash combination. The code could be decoded at the receiving end and the message could be sent. Through the telegraph, messages could be sent to any part of the world in a few hours. Teleprinter The teleprinter is an automatic typewriter printer. It sends messages over telegraph or other data communication lines to a similar receiving printer, which automatically prints the message. Teleprinters convert typed words into electrical signals at the transmitting end and signals into typed words at the receiving end. The teleprinter was first developed by Frederick G. Creed in 1927. Through teleprinter, we can send messages three times faster than an ordinary telegraph. Telephone The telephone is the fastest means of communication. Today, we can talk to people in far-off cities or even in different countries through the STD, Subscriber Trunk Dialing, and ISD, International Subscriber Dialing. Telephone facilities are available in all cities, towns, and most of the villages these days. India has made great progress in the telecommunication sector in recent years. Telephone services are better and much cheaper than before. Cellular phones are also being increasingly used. Facsimile Machine The first facsimile machine was invented in 1842 by Scottish clockmaker and inventor Alexander Bain. A fax machine is like a scanning machine. It scans a document, making a digital image of it. Then it sends this digital image to another fax machine using its internal modem. The fax machine on the other end downloads that image and prints it. It is connected with a phone line. It has numbers so that the sent or received fax can be identified by the fax number. Info Hive it was Alexander Graham Bell who invented the telephone in 1817. We can now talk to a distant person over a telephone. Info Hive It used to take six minutes to send just a single page fax in 1924 
and 3 minutes in 1974, it takes only 1.7 seconds to send a single page of fax today. Email The electronic mail, email, was invented by American Ray Tomlinson. We can send messages by electronic mail and the internet to any part of the world on the computers. The internet is a worldwide computer network by which a user can connect his computer to another computer in any part of the world. Email is a very inexpensive means of communication. We can send videos, pictures or sounds along with text messages via email through computers. Each email account has a unique address. A general format for an email address is username at domain name myself at yahoo.com username domain name info hi the first call was between alexander graham bell and his assistant thomas watson mass communication when we have to communicate with a big group of people or many people at one time we have to use means of mass communication books newspapers magazines radio television cinema the internet and advertisements are different means of mass communication print media printing was invented by johannes gutenberg of germany in 1443 the first printed newspaper was published in 1609 in germany print media includes books newspapers and magazines all these give us news and information about the whole world a newspaper has something for everybody it gives opinions, information and news of interest from every corner of the world. In India, newspapers and magazines are published in English, Hindi and regional languages. Today, millions of books are printed every year. Popular books are also translated into other languages. This makes reading easy for people. Books and magazines printed in one country are easily available in other countries. Info Hive The first theatre in the world exclusively devoted to showing motion pictures was the Nickelodeon. Radio and Television Those who cannot read or write can listen to the radio or watch programs on television. These two means of mass communication have revolutionized our everyday life. Now, we can listen to news and discussions and enjoy the different programs of entertainment without leaving home. On radio and television, there are also programs for students and farmers. Now, we can see films at home with our family. We can even watch events as they are happening in any part of the world sitting at home. We can also learn about the habits and culture of the people of different parts of the world. Info Hive Radio was invented by Gaglaimo Marconi, an Italian scientist, in 1901. Television was invented by Scottish inventor John Logie Baird in 1926. Internet The Internet was invented in the United States during the late 1950s to the 1970s by a group of scientists. It connects millions of computers together globally by a network. Through the network, any computer can communicate with any other computer. There are over 1 billion websites on the Internet. We can get information on any topic through these websites. A website address looks like this. www.icurious.com Cinema Cinema is the most popular means of mass communication. It helps to spread knowledge and education, especially through short films called documentaries. Through cinema, we know more about the culture of people living in different parts of the world. Lumiere brothers were the first to present motion picture, photographic pictures and short films. In 1895, Lumiere brothers invented the first motion picture camera. In 1895, they released the first motion film on a screen. Advertisements Advertisement is another medium of communicating with the common people. 
Only educated people can read advertisements that are printed in newspapers and magazines. But advertisements on radio and television can be understood by even uneducated people. Nowadays, we can also see advertisements on the internet. Social awareness programs are spread through advertisements by the government. Every means of communication is useful in its own way. Together, they help us to keep in touch with our friends, relatives and the world. Recap With the invention of the printing press, more books began to be printed in less time. Telegraph was an early system of sending messages over long distances by buyers. Telephone is the fastest means of communication. The internet is a worldwide computer network by which a user can connect his computer to any computer in any part of the world.